Hello, how to solve square root of x plus x is equal to x times square root of x? To find the value of x from this equation. So first, for the value of x to satisfy the equation, we should know that x should be greater than or equal to 0. Then from here, square root of x and this square root of x, we let t is equal to square root of x. So when we square on both sides, it will be t square is equal to x. Then from here, square root of x is t square. Square root of x is t. So it will be t plus x is t square. Then it's equal to x times square root of x. It will be t square times t. Then it will be t plus t square is equal to t square times t is t power of 3. Then we take t square and t into the, into the right side. So it will be 0 is equal to t power of 3 minus t square minus t. Then it will be 0 is equal to, as in here t is common, so we take t out of bracket, t power of 3 divided by t is t square, negative t square divided by t is negative t, negative t divided by t is negative 1 bracket. Then from this side we have two solutions, whereas first solution is t is equal to 0, and the second solution is this t square minus t minus 1 is equal to 0. Therefore, from this first solution, t is equal to 0, and this quadratic equation will solve by quadratic formula, whereas a is equal to coefficient of t square is 1, and b is equal to coefficient of t is negative 1, and c is equal to constant is negative 1. Now, from quadratic formula, t is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then it will be t is equal to negative b is negative 1 plus or minus square root of b square to be negative 1 bracket square minus 4 times a is 1 times c is negative 1. Then over 2 times a is 1. So, it will be t is equal to negative and negative to be positive 1 plus or minus square root of negative 1 square is 1. Negative 4 times 1 times negative 1 is positive 4. Then over 2 times 1 is 2. Then it will be t is equal to 1 plus or minus square root of this plus this is 5 over 2. Now because of plus or minus, in here we have two solutions, whereas first value of t is equal to 1 is positive to be 1 plus square root of 5 over 2, and the second value of t is equal to 1 is negative is 1 minus square root of 5 over 2. But this value is, ne is negative, whereas to satisfy the equation, it should be positive value or zero. So this is negative, so is as it is less than zero, so it will not satisfy the equation. So we'll deal with this solution and this value of t is equal to zero. But before, so but t is equal to this square root of x. So it will be square root of x is equal to 0. Then we square on both sides, so it will be x is equal to 0. Therefore, this is the first value of x. And the second value of x, from here 1 plus square root of 5 over 2, as we know t, we let before t is square root of x is equal to, it will be equal to this. 1 plus square root of 5 over 2. Then we will square in both sides. So 
this square root will cancel with square so it will be x is equal to this square to be this times itself so it will be 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 then bracket bracket 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 bracket then it will be x is equal to 1 times 1 is 1 1 times square root of 5 to be plus square root of 5 square root of 5 times 1 it will be plus square root of 5 then plus square root of 5 times square root of 5 is 5 then over 2 times 2 is 4 then it will be x is equal to 1 plus 5 is 6 plus square root of 5 plus square root of 5 is 2 square root of 5 then we divide by 4 in each part so divide by 4 here and here so it will be x is equal to 6 divided by 4 here to simplify by divide by 2 is 3 divided by 2 is 2 so it will be 3 over 2 then plus this will cancel by 1 and this by 2 so it will be square root of 5 over 2 therefore this is the second value of x thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye